My dad was the best father, a heart of gold, did everything for his family. Elias Kitsopoulos died at the age of 67. He was with his wife, Constantina, at the time when he was hit and killed. His daughter, Sue, said her parents were inseparable. She will never forget the day she lost her dad 10 years ago. That day, her parents walked to Tim Hortons and were enjoying a coffee. Sue happened to be driving by. I saw my dad. He saw me. He blew a kiss to me. And that was the last time I saw. That was the last time. It's like he knew he wouldn't see me again, but he blew a kiss and that was it. Hours later, Elias was killed. The couple was crossing Green Road on the south side of Barton Street East when they were struck by an SUV that Hamilton police said was traveling southbound. Elias was dragged 100 meters as the vehicle continued south into a nearby neighborhood. Sue's mother was also hurt and is still recovering, but mentally she will never get over what happened that night on March 22nd, 2011. Nothing's going to bring my father back, but knowing why it happened and how, that's what we need to know. All police know is that it was a dark SUV that took off, and the license plate has four letters followed with three numbers, beginning with a B. Someone has told their friend, their neighbor, their cousin, their sister, uh, perhaps a auto body shop at that time did repair work. There's now a $25,000 reward through City Council and the Police Service Board for information leading to an arrest. Give them any information you have, a little tip, anything will help. Someone has developed a conscience over the last 10 years. Please, we urge them to come forward. Like the Kostopoulos family, there are many others looking for justice. The police service tweeted out a list of cases that need to be solved with rewards totaling $275,000. It's all to help bring closure to 13 families of homicide and hit and run victims. 13 families, multiple families within each case that have been impacted. The oldest on the list dates back to 1995. A house to house canvas was underway as police continued to search for leads in the murder of 19 year old Helen Gillings. Three cases have $50,000 reward values assigned, like the investigation of missing person Cheryl Shepard. She hasn't been seen or heard from since New Year's Day 1998, hours after her boyfriend proposed to her live on the air during a CHCH New Year's Eve show. In 1998, I'd like to ask you to marry me, Cheryl. There's the proposal. Police are also hoping someone has information to lead to the arrests in Angelo Musitano's murder in Waterdown in 2017.